Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this lecture, we will study the remaining two feedback amplifiers. So the third feedback amplifier is the current series feedback. Again, the first term indicates the sampling and sampling always takes place at the output side. So therefore, at the output side, we are going to have a current over here because we have current sampling here. The second term indicates the mixing and we have mixing at the input side. And this series mixing is also called as voltage mixing because voltages are added or subtracted in series. So on the input side, the input signal is going to be voltage. Also, this series indicates that the feedback network and the input network is going to be in series. So we are going to have a feedback network and input network in series. Now this is the configuration of the current series feedback amplifier. So the output signal is going to be current let us denote it by I0 and this I0 is actually the same as IL. If IL is flowing in this resistor RL, this road resistor RL, so I0 will be equal to IL. Now what will be A equal to? A will be equal to output divided by the input. So output is I0, input is VI because we have uh, input of voltage. So input is voltage. So we have gain given by I0 by VI. Now what will be the factor B? Because we are taking the part of uh, uh, output current and feeding it to the uh, feedback network. That is why this VF is going to be equal to, so this I0 will come over here. We are going to have I0 over here and this VF will be equal to the beta times the I0. So VF will be equal to beta times I0 and beta will be equal to I0 divided by Vf. So this is the configuration of current series feedback. This is current series feedback amplifier. And this current series feedback amplifier is also called transconductance amplifier. Transconductance amplifier. Because here A is equal to I0 by Vi. So this is the reciprocal of resistance or this is conductance so that is why it is called the transconductance amplifier and here again if we find the i naught in terms of a then i naught will be equal to a v i so this was about the current series feedback amplifier which is also called the transconductance amplifier next is the current shunt feedback amplifier again the first term indicates the sampling so at the output because we have current sampling so at the output we are going to have current the second term indicates the mixing and because we have shunt mixing over here and shunt mixing is also called current mixing because currents are added or subtracted in parallel. So that is why the input component is going is also going to be current and because we have shunt over here so the feedback network and input network is going to be in connected in shunt. The feedback and input networks are going to be connected in some in shunt. So this is the current shunt, current shunt feedback amplifier where we have current sampling and shunt mixing. So now we have the input signal which is the current signal and we suppose that the current II is flowing to this amplifier. And at the output side we also going to have a current. So let's suppose we have I0 over here and this I0 is actually equal to the IL. So this I0 is going to come over here and this there we are going to have the feedback as current because the feedback is also going to be current over here. So this will be equal to IF is equal to beta I0 which means that beta is going to be equal to IF divided by I0. And this gain is equal to the output by input so this will be equal to I0 by I in. So this is the current shunt feedback amplifier and this is also called the current amplifier because it is used for current amplification as we have output current divided by the input current. So this is my current shunt feedback amplifier where I have current sampling and shunt mixing. Shunt mixing is also called current mixing. So at the output we are going to have current at the input we are also going to have current. So in current shunt feedback amplifier all signals are current signals. In current shunt feedback amplifier all signals are current signals. Thank you.